Germany is considered one of the top classical music nations. Superstar composers like Bach, Beethoven and Wagner are famous all over the world. And we've been making orchestral music for around 500 years. But is modern Germany still interested in this traditional art form? Germany has 133 professional orchestras, one quarter of all professional orchestras in the world. Vigor is off to the German capital to see if the inhabitants know their great German composers. The first one I think about is Brahms. Um, Beethoven or Bach? The most famous uh, of all is Mike Schumacher. Hmm, well I'm not so sure about the last one. That wasn't so impressive, but let's see if I can make a little money with my interpretations of classical music's greatest hits. Vigor has very little to show for all that effort, but classical music in Germany generally benefits from public subsidies, so there may be hope. German orchestras apparently get 82% of their financing from state handouts. It's a lot of money, but is it well spent? What kind of reputation do German orchestras have internationally? German orchestras do have an uh, outstanding reputation in the worldwide uh, orchestra scene uh, due to the special German sound they produce. The investment in classical music seems to be paying off. For the concert going public, it also means that tickets are affordable. Figure is attending a free lunchtime concert given in the Berliner Philharmonie. What do you like about the lunch concert? Um, that it's very casual. You can just come here, you can wear your jeans, you can sit on the floor. Um, it's for free. Just uh -huh. a great atmosphere, really. And the music is great. So. Right. Classical music is shaking off its conservative reputation. Time for an evaluation from an industry expert. How has the market for classical music changed? The market is changing right now. It's getting more open. The audience is getting younger. The artists are getting younger. Mm -hmm. And they are more, more modern. They are more sexy. So oh. that's changing. I still have my classical music instruments, but I didn't make so much money with them. Let's see how German passers-by react when confronted with a classical music instrument on the street. This woman has no hesitation about getting to grips with classical music. Wow! But these two young men seem to have got the wrong end of the stick. This very suspicious looking character is interested for all the wrong reasons. Stop! Thief! The final passerby apparently knows how to tune a violin and his plucking technique is revolutionary. Germans and classical music are clearly a winning combination. Innovation and cash injections are ensuring Germany stays ahead of the field and the next Beethoven is probably already in the making. Vigor is inspired enough to give it another go. The search goes on. The search for the truth about Germany.